Good morning, folks. Welcome back to Fanny for the Soul, and uh, we continue our uh, series of uh, you know Escape Goa River Marathon stories. So uh, this is this time it is uh, my uh, friend, uh, formerly from Goa, now in Gurgaon, Aparna Aparna Paul Seth, who is a very uh, avid marathoner and uh, you know corporate executive, a mother of two children. So um, Aparna, uh, you know, I'm, she's going to tell us a wonderful story of how she transformed from a, a kind of, a, a, you know, heavy, heavily built or rather, uh, you know, stocky lady to a very, uh, you know, almost, uh, what do you call it, uh, uh, you know, model, absolutely model looks and model uh, runner, you know, so uh, th that she'll tell us that story. So I'm going to kick off by asking uh, uh, Aparna uh, by showing a photograph, really. So Aparna, please tell us how um, this transformation took place because the photograph, this is a before after photograph of Aparna. And, and uh, like Aparna has told me, uh, you know, very sportingly that she was uh, always very heavy. And this is a photograph uh, just uh, before her second child. And this is uh, on the right is the photograph of how she looks now, you know, uh, because she's such an avid runner. So Aparna, tell us in your own words, how did this transformation take place? Uh, so, uh, I was always a heavy child. I was always a fat child. Uh, since my school and college days and my classmate used to tease me, bullies me because of my weight. And it never came to my mind that I do something to keep myself fit because I'm a very foodie also. So I used, I love eating food now also, but now I run. So I was always like fat kid during my marriage also. But after kids, like I gained almost 30, 35 kilo of weight. So I was like 120 kg after my second daughter born. So uh, after that, around 2015, I thought like I'll take a break from my job and do something. I'll not waste my time and waste time on myself instead of like watching TV or partying something. So I started uh, a gym. I, it was a nearby gym in Goa. So I started, I joined the gym. I started doing gymming and uh, slowly, slowly, I lost almost like 30, 35 kg. And it like gave me confidence. In a year, I lost 30, 35 kg. And with healthy habits also, eating habits also, I changed. So I stopped eating junk. I stopped eating sweet. And like I was to eat only healthy foods. So I lost around 20, 30, 35 kg. And in year 2016, November, so my husband was actually pacing 21 kilometer in Goa River Marathon. And he registered myself for 10K and before asking me. And he said, you can run 10K. I said, oh, I was not very confident because I never ran before. So I started running around my apartment slowly, slowly, 3K, 4K, 5K. And then I ran almost 8K. And then I got this confidence that I can run 10K in December. Within a month, I train myself. So then December, 11 December, 2016, I ran my first 10K in Goa River Marathon. And it was like such a good feeling. I felt like I did something very good. And the medal which I received, it was like so precious to me. I still look at that medal and remember all those old days. So it's like so precious. The first Goa River Marathon, 2016, 10K. Wonderful. So this is how wow. I started. Uh, so, so what does Aparna, what does running mean to you today? You know, because now uh, if you, if you follow you, if we follow you on Instagram or Strava, you are, you know, running almost 10 kilometers every day and you do a half marathon on Sundays with your husband, you know, Sachin. So uh, what does running mean to you today? So it's like uh, to keep myself fit. I run every day. I gym every day. I eat healthy food. And I try to like, it's like a stress buster for me. And uh, like uh, for keeping me healthy, it's like fitting fit, I need run. So before, without run, I don't feel like eating. Sometimes it's like, if I go for a party, I thought I'll first I'll run and then go for a party. So that let's come in my mind. So I run every day, I do my gym, I follow healthy lifestyle. So this is how like, I'm now working on myself. Wonderful. So it, uh, it is almost like a mantra to you now. You know, without running, uh, the day is not complete, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah. On my rest days also, I just do maybe one or two K on treadmill. So it's like I, I'll do something every day. Wonderful. Has, has that, uh, have you been able to inspire, uh, let's say, other ladies in your age group uh, in Gurgaon 
you know in your society where you live in gurgaon have have they got inspired by looking at you a yeah, few of my classmate i don't want to mention her ma- name uh, she is like she was uh, studying with me in college and school and college so she was like very inspired with me and she started little bit of jogging running she is not a proper runner but she started a healthy lifestyle now she is doing a little bit of jogging and walking and she lost almost 20 25 kg and uh, i thought i'll introduce her in my instagram page but uh, she was like she don't want to be in public but uh, i i really uh, that's like a very precious moment for me because she still uh, in touch with me she calls me almost every week and she asks me how to do further how to uh, continue with this and i i whatever tip whatever like in knowledge i have i give her so i share with her and that's like a very precious thing so no no that's 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 wonderful you know because that that's i think uh, very important that not only have you transformed yourself but you are inspiring uh, others also that's what i wanted to ask yeah so but, there are many followers in my instagram say they ask me like how to start running and all like few of my school friends and colleagues ex colleagues so they ask me and i generally give them tips like how so you can start with run walk technique and you can just start with slow jog so they are, there are many people who is asking me on instagram so they follow me and they wanted to be like good runner like they wanted to be a fit person so oh, it's nice. a good feeling ha huh? wonderful wonderful uh, coming to sachin your husband who is a marathoner himself so how um, let me uh, how how much has that helped you you know in in your journey as a runner yeah sachin is always inspiration for me because uh, he's having a health uh, is like very hectic work life so still he manage his fitness he goes to gym regularly he does his runs he uh, he keeps himself uh, fit with all those hectic uh, work schedule so it's definitely an inspiration for me and he helped me also during my running journey because when we started running when i started running my daughter was very small and we didn't had any support like family support at home so he used to finish his run earlier than me so that he come home and do the baby sitting and i can go with the group marga sosegada runner for the my regular runs so he used to help me and he inspired me every day even now he is inspiring me every day like whenever i'm feeling low i run with him and i feel so good because of his energy and his like positivity he's like she always give that good vibe so fantastic like fantastic. i'm lucky sure. to have him no no sure sure this is so so nice to hear this you know that um, husband wife bonding over running and you know shared responsibilities fantastic so final question uh, aparna you know and that is uh, uh, why is uh, skf goa river marathon so close to your heart you know uh, why is it special why is this marathon special because you run in so many marathons but why is this special you know yeah it is uh, special as i shared with you my running journey started with 10k 2016 goa river marathon and it was my son's birthday on that day so this date i will never forget 11 december 2016 was my son's birthday and then uh, if you see uh, my journey i like actually my first half marathon was also in goa river marathon 2017 and my first full marathon was also uh, 2018 42 kilometers in goa river marathon and my second full marathon in 2019 i i actually it has a like very special feeling whenever i start running like last four year i'm running this uh, marathon whenever i start i feel like it's like my first day of running i have that goosebump i remember all those fear which i had four years five years back all those memory comes that in that route entire route is like so 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 close to my heart i know each and every route and then the river and the climbs i just enjoy that run so it's like so close so Fantastic. yeah so i just go with it so i that's why we are coming specially to goa for this marathon and, and then of course you have all your madgaon susegad runners group yeah, and my so many friends. friends yes 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 and they are like so uh, always like aparna aparna you do good you do good and they all are like chasing me and like them like they are so good not so good to run with them margao sosegad runners yeah. all are like so close to a yeah, huge contingent from uh, msr taking part right so anyway uh, thank you for your time aparna and look forward thank to you. seeing you uh, at at the at the race 
on December 12th. So all, right, all the best. Take care of yourself. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.